Hello everybody and welcome to I Like Cruise Ships, the YouTube channel and welcome aboard Carnival Horizon. We've got a great opportunity today. We're going to get a look at one of the Havana Cabana suites. This is 5233. So this is the back of deck five. We've got the big Havana balcony that we'll show you in a little bit. Let's have a quick look at the cabin and let's go and have a look at the bathroom. So Havana Cabana suites, you've got this nice darker wood on the door here. There is four of them on board. And my plan is to get all four of them on to the channel. I've got, this is the third one so far, so hopefully I can get all four of them. So one thing that you'll notice is the uh, tiled floor and then this tiled splashback as well. And then the actual counter here is a, rather than a kind of a plastic, which is on a lot of the rooms, it's actually a, like a stone countertop. So you've got storage underneath, You've got storage here by the mirror. It's a huge mirror, by the way. Okay, the toilet we're pretty used to. Lots of towels. And then this huge shower here with the rain shower on top as well. So you've got the normal head and then the rain shower head. And then you've got shower gel and shampoo. There is no conditioner. And you've got this seat as well. How cool is that seat? Oh, big shower. So yeah, very nice bathroom. A lot of space. Um, yeah, let's take a look at the rest of the room, shall we? So when you come into the room, you've got the uh, switch here for the lights. You can put a card in there now. The secret of the room is you can put any card in that switch. And it'll work the big king-size bed again. So we've got this Havana kind of feel to the room. It's a little bit darker paneling on the walls. Now you can actually store under the bed your luggage. There is a ton of space. And there's plenty of clearance as well. So. If you are planning to store something right there. So we have three wardrobes. Let's have a look. We've got one with the shelves and drawers and safe. And then we've got two over here. Now that's a little bit close, but I'm pretty sure that can move over a little bit. No worries. And then we've got the full hanging and then the half hanging on the other side. And this shelf actually goes up as well. So you can actually create a full hanger. It's another secret of the cabin. So yeah, these little side tables. Let's just switch on and off. So yeah, this is a nice big bed. So now the advantage of this room as well is you've got two TVs. Now, I think everybody needs two TVs in their house. But in the cabin, that's a lot of TVs. And then you've got this dividing kind of uh, section here between the, the bed and then I guess the, the lounge area. And then there is a curtain here that can pull across. You can see this track here. I'm not going to get it dizzy. We'll spin around. And then right on the desk, then you've got the plugs. There's a USB, 110 and 220. You have a very heavy chair here as well. This Havana chair is a lot heavier than what you're used to. And some nice deep drawers as well. So you get extra drawers on the desk. And you've got the hair dryer right there and then on the other side we have the fridge as well nice for some sodas some water and then so this actually a sofa here can be made up into a third bed so you've got lots of room here if you do have extra people more than two now I imagine three people then you've got a secret right here it's basically this is where they actually pull out to make the bed so it's actually kind of like a, a trundle bed I guess you would call it it makes up to be the third bed and we've got the TV so all right let's have a look at the balcony shall we as well so this is the cabana right here so check this out how cool lots of space so we've got the full sun bed and then you've got the side table and then the very famous, very famous, what do you call this, chess wing. So yeah, and we got the extra chair. All right, so we can see here all the other rooms. So these are actually basically marked as well. So you can see the cabin numbers all the way along. So it's very handy. And then we'll just spin around and we can get a bit of an idea of the space. And then basically from the gate right here, just right here, you can walk then to the back area, which is the lounge and bar area. So yeah, 
got a lot of space. One thing that I always point out here is that it's not fully shaded. It's kind of like a gazebo style roof, but it's not completely shaded, but you've got plenty of coverage uh, from the sun. And you obviously are quite close to your neighbors, so that's the one thing that you always know. So the whole thing with the Havana cabins is the neighbors are basically directly next to you. So as long as you're kind of comfortable with that, it's very easy to get an idea of the, where we are. So yeah, let's go back inside and check out the rest of the room, shall we? There's quite a few people just walking by there. So the other thing that's different about Havana here is you've got the actual different towels as well, which are for use in the Havana area. So yeah, you've got the light. Ooh, there we go, I'm in the video again, gosh. So yeah, beautiful room. I hope you've liked this walk around. I like cruise ships, the YouTube channel. We're here on board Carnival Horizon. We're making plenty of videos. And that light's just coming in. It's beautiful. You don't really need any light on in the room because you get plenty of uh, natural light as well. So thanks for watching the channel. I like cruise ships, the YouTube channel. If you haven't uh, subscribed, click subscribe to the channel. Notification bell for more videos. And if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Oh, you can say hi to the cabin steward. Are you going to say hi? No, he's too focused. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. Have a nice day. Bye.